we are prepared for the very first contest. I have with me St. Francis Xavier, all the way from the north, and Keta Senior High Technical, taking the first contest. Now the contest is going to be in four parts, so we're going to have four rounds. And so at the beginning of every round, I'll tell you the rules, the possible marks that you're likely to score for a question answered correctly, and the question that you get wrong, what the penalty is. And you're going to have a series of questions, eight questions in all. Now, because of the structure of the round, we would have to determine which school goes first and which school goes second. So you give me one candidate from St. Francis Xavier, one from Keta Senior High School. We take a toss of the coin, heads or tails. You're okay with heads. So we take a toss of the coin, and he wins. Please put your hands together for him. And so Keta Senior High School, the right corner round starts with you. Question one, who captained the Black Stars of Ghana in her first ever World Cup? Steven Apia. Steven Apia is correct for 10 points. Question two, which statutory agency is in charge of regulating, overseeing, and monitoring the petroleum downstream sector in Ghana to ensure Yes, Francis? National Petroleum Authority. National Petroleum Authority, ladies and gentlemen, is correct for 10 points. Question three. Who was the host of the children's show, quote, by the fireside, unquote, that chronicled the numerous misadventures of Kwekuanansi, the legendary spider in the Ghanaian folk tales, and popularly referred to as Mame Dokolo? Efwa Sandland. I'm sorry, I can't give you that. You lost a point to that question. The correct answer to that question is Grace Omabu. Question four. The Kweku Festival is noted for this new adventure sport. Kweku Festival, sorry, is noted for this new adventure sport, which involves flying. What is the name of the festival? What's the name of the sport, sir? Paragliding. Paragliding is correct, ladies and gentlemen, for 10 points. Question five. What is the name of the first woman vice president and president who served as the longest serving president of the Ghana Journalist Association? No idea? Well, the bell is rang. It's Honorable Gifty Afeni Dazi. Question six. Who is the minister of education who oversaw the implementation of the free senior high school policy? Yes, Francis. Matthew Opoku Prempe. Honorable Matthew Opoku Prempe is correct for 10 points. Name the first female speaker of parliament and an alumni of the Holy Child School. Yes, Francis? Joyce Bamford Ado. Joyce Adeline Bamford Ado is correct for 10 points. Which president was the National Hockey Stadium renamed after? Francis? Professor Evans Atamils. The late President John Evans Atamils. And that brings us to the end of the right corner round for Keta Senior High School. Here we go. Question one, St. Francis Xavier. Now a UNESCO ambassador for clean stoves, who is the second lady of the Republic of Ghana? Miss Rebecca Kufadu. I'm sorry, I can't give you that answer is wrong. The correct answer is Samira Baumia. Question two, what is the name of the first female graduate of the University College of the Gold Coast? The bell was rang, the correct answer is Elizabeth Frances Barbassé, who lived from 1927 to 1991. Question three, the Minister of State in charge of tertiary education is? Yes, Roger. Kwesi Anka. Professor Kwesi Anka is correct for 10 points. Question four. What is the full name of the Ghanaian student who made it to the top 45 finals of the Scripps National Spelling Bee held in the US in the year 2016? The bell has gone. The correct answer is Ifwa Ansa. Manu Kuri. Question five. Ghana's first UN Secretary General attended which senior high school 
touted as the oldest in the country. Yes, Roger. In farm space in, in the school. school is correct for 10 points. Question six. What is the name of the former chief justice who was recently sworn in as the last of the 25 member council of state? Yes, Roger. Theodora Georgina Wood. Georgina Theodora Wood is correct. Which statutory agency of the government of Ghana promulgates standards, promotes standardization, and undertakes conformity assessment activities in the country? Yes, Nathaniel? Ghana Standards Authority. The Ghana Standards Authority is correct for 10 points. Which African country made Dr. Kwame Nkrumah a, an honorary co-president? Yes, Roger. Gambia. I'm sorry I can't give you that. The Gambia is wrong. The correct answer is Guinea. The country of Guinea made Osajifu Dr. Kwame Nkrumah the co-president of that particular country. And that brings us to the end of the right corner round. Please put your hands together for them. At the end of round one, ladies and gentlemen, Keta Senior High School comes up with 60 points. And St. Francis Xavier comes up with 40 points. The best things here at Webster in terms of our academics are small classroom settings. Allowing you to have that feel of just being alone with the teacher. You get a glimpse of the world in a classroom. The school is an inclusive school. I can't think of a better place to study than Webster. It's a place you could grow without doing much. Not only do they make you feel like you can succeed, you know you can succeed. We have a lot of interesting courses. Socially, it's like a family. It feels like family. We have a lot of seminars by the students, and it gives you a lot of time to flourish and develop yourself. We're diverse, and it's beautiful. Everyone is very inclusive of everyone else. Webster will not only change you, it will transform your group. Webster University is an American university with full-service campuses in the USA, Switzerland, Netherlands, Greece, China, the UK, Austria, Thailand, and Ghana. Now in round two, the questions are going to be tossed to both schools. If you feel you have the answer to the question, you ring the bell. The bell I hear first gets the opportunity to answer the question. Answer the question correctly, you get 10 points and an additional bonus question, which is worth five points. So if you answer both questions correct, you have a total of 15 points. If the first answer you give me to both schools is wrong, you get a deduction of five points. First question to both schools. If Kwame can make three pots in 50 minutes, how many pots can he shave in five hours? Yes, get us in high school. 5,000 pots. 5,000 pots, that is wrong. I'm sorry, I cannot give you that. St. Francis Xavier, the bell rang, and so you forfeit the opportunity to answer the question. The correct answer, ladies and gentlemen, is 18 pots. Question two. Let P equals three, exponent Q plus one, and Q equals two R. Then P on three squared equals... The bell is rang, and so you both forfeit the opportunity to get 10 points and a possible penalty of five points. The correct answer is three exponent two R minus one. The next question, both schools. There's a caveat, so I'll read the caveat. I will read the definition of a given clue regarding a word that begins with the letters cat, C-A-T. You identify the word described. A, any substance that speeds up a chemical reaction. Yes, St. Francis Xavier. Catalyst. A catalyst is correct for 10 points. And so you get the bonus question, which reads, a summary of religious doctrine in the form of questions and answers. The bell is gone. The answer is catechism. A complete enumeration of items of a book that or a book that contains yes, it has in your high school catalog. Catalog is correct, ladies and gentlemen, for ten points. 
And so you get the bonus question. A momentous, tragic event. Yes, Calamity. Ka catastrophe. Catastrophe is correct for five points. The next question. An elongated worm-like lava of a butterfly or more. Yes, St. Francis Xavier. A caterpillar. Caterpillar is correct for 10 points. And so you get the five point bonus question. A cleansing or purification of emotions through talking. The bell is gone. The correct answer is catharsis. A general class to which an item or a person belongs. St. Francis Xavier, I had your bell. Uh, can you tell guys to add your bell before my bell rings? I'll give you the opportunity to answer the question. Category. Category is correct, ladies and gentlemen, for 10 points. And so you get the bonus question. Clouding of the lens of the eye in humans or animals. Cataract. Yes, cataract is correct for five points. An ancient device once used to hurl stones or burning debris in battle. A yes, catapult. Sir Francis Xavier. A catapult. A catapult, ladies and gentlemen, is correct for 10 points. And so you get the bonus question. A great flood, earthquake, or violent physical change in the air. I'm sorry, my bell is gone. You forfeit the five points. The correct answer is cataclysm. And that brings me to the end of round two. Please put your hands together for them. Now, at the end of round two, Keta Senior High School came up with 30 points. And St. Francis Xavier scored 40 points. Now, the third round is a steam round. The questions are going to be on science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Unfortunately, I don't have bonus questions in this round. And so if you give me a wrong answer, we'll deduct five points for penalty. If the answer is correct, you get 10 points. First question, both schools. As you go down into a well, your weight A increases slightly, B decreases slightly, C remains exactly the same. Yes, Sir Francis Xavier? Decreases slightly. Decreases slightly, ladies and gentlemen, is correct for 10 points. Question two. What is the name given to the process discovered by Goodyear for adding sulfur to heated rubber? Yes, vulcanization. Vulcanization is correct for 10 points. Question three, short answer. Used primarily in fertilizers, which element is never found free in nature, even though it makes up 2.5% of the Earth's crust? Yes, in Francis Xavier. Nitrogen. I'm sorry, you lose five points. The correct answer is not nitrogen. My bell is gone. Kita Senior High School, you forfeit the opportunity to answer the question. The correct answer is potassium. Potassium. Question four. Short answer. What element whose symbol derived from the Latin for liquid silver? Yes, in Mercury. Mercury is correct. 10 points for Keta Senior High School. What poisonous alkaloid is extracted from tobacco leaves? And 
Ketan Senior High School. Nicotine. Nicotine is correct for 10 points. What is the name for steel alloy with chromium? Ketan Senior High School. Nichrome. I'm sorry, you lose five points. Nichrome is not the correct answer. And my bell is gone. The correct answer is stainless steel. What is the slope of the line passing through the points 1, 9, and 8, 16? Yes, Ketan Senior High School? One. The slope is one, ladies and gentlemen. That is correct. We go to the next question. Find both roots of the equation x squared minus 5x plus 4. Yes, St. Francis Xavier? 1 and 4. 1 and 4, ladies and gentlemen, is correct for 10 points. And that takes us to the next question. What is the volume? What is the volume of a sphere with a surface area of 900 pi square unit? Yes, Kita City High School? 200 pi square unit. Pardon? 200 cream. I'm sorry, that answer is wrong. And so you lose five points. Yes, St. Francis Xavier? 1,300 I am sorry that answer is also wrong, so that school also loses five points. The correct answer is 4,500 pi cubic units. Also 30 seconds for computation. Find the length of the hypotenuse of a right triangle whose smaller length has the length seven and whose longer length has a length one less than the hypotenuse. Yes, Kitan Senior High School? 25. 25 is correct, ladies and gentlemen, for 10 points. What is the mean of the set 3, 5, 20, and 80? 27. I heard the bell first, but Tw you were not acknowledged. And so I am going to take five points from you, even though the answer is correct. The average of six consecutive integers in increasing order of size is nine. What is the average of the last three integers? I'm sorry, my bell is gone, and so you both forfeit the opportunity to get 10 points. The correct answer is 11. And that brings me to the end of round three. Please put your hands together for that. Now, at the end of round three, Ketar Senior High School comes up with 40 points, and St. Francis Xavier comes up with five points. Now, I suppose this is enough steam that launches us into the final round of the contest. The best things here at Webster in terms of our academics are our small classroom settings. Allowing you to have that feel of just being alone with the teacher. You get a glimpse of the world in a classroom. The school is an inclusive school. I can't think of a better place to study than Webster. It's a place you could grow without doing much. Not only do they make you feel like you can succeed, you know you can succeed. We have a lot of interesting courses. Socially, it's like a family. It feels like family. We have a lot of seminars by the students and it gives you a lot of time to flourish and develop yourself. We're diverse and it's beautiful. Everyone is very inclusive of everyone else. Webster will not only change you, it will transform your world. Webster University is an American university with full service campuses in the USA, Switzerland, Netherlands, Greece, China, the UK, Austria, Thailand, and Ghana. Now, in the final round, we have questions on science, math, English, literature, and general knowledge. What I want you to do is to agree amongst yourself, if you have already done that, great. But let us know who will be responsible for any of these disciplines. Now, who do we have for Keta? Maxwell. We have Maxwell. And for St. Francis Xavier? Nathaniel. Nathaniel. Question one, in a namesake reaction, some of them can react with the basis of methyl, methyl ketone to create carbolic acid. The heaviest example is the rarest naturally occurring element, 
on earth. And the deficiency of another member is often the cause of a goiter. Yes, I heard Keta Senior High School. The group seven element or the halogens. Halogens, ladies and gentlemen, is correct for 10 points. Question two. When used with resistors, they can be used to eliminate signals above or below desired frequencies in high pass and low pass filters. The quantity associated with these objects is equal to charge over voltage. And the function of one can be improved. Yes, St. Francis Xavier. Capacitor. Capacitor is correct for 10 points. Gentlemen, please step away from the mic. And those responsible for the math questions can assume their positions by the microphone. Who do we have for Kitasi High School? Godfred. Godfred. And for St. Francis Xavier? Joseph. Joseph. If the average of five numbers is negative 10 and the sum of three of the numbers is 16, then what is the average of the other two numbers? I'm sorry, my bell is gone. You both forfeit the opportunity to answer the, correct, the question correctly and get 10 points. The correct answer is negative 33. The second question. The seventh number in the sequence of numbers is 31. And each number after the first number in the sequence is four less than the number immediately preceding it. What is the fourth number in the sequence? Yes. 19. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to deduct five. And my bell is gone. And so the correct answer is 43. English and literature. Who do we have for Keta Senior High School? Doji. Doji and for St. Francis Xavier? Raymond. Raymond. So Raymond going against Doji. Your first question. What device or technique is achieved in the following? Here comes my brilliant son who failed his final examination. Yes, St. Francis Xavier? It's irony. I'm not going to accept irony. I'm not going to accept irony. That's not correct. And so you lose five points. And my bell is gone. Here comes my brilliant son who failed his exams completely. Exactly as I thought. <laughs> and so I am sure I have been very fair. And I can take the opportunity away from Doji of Keta Senior High School. The correct answer, ladies and gentlemen, is sarcasm so the second question for the both of you when the stomach entered the room all went dead quiet yes st francis xavier it's personification i'm sorry that is wrong you lose another five points and doji you also rang the bell and my bell ladies and gentlemen is gone and so he also loses the opportunity to answer the question the correct answer is sinek the king sinek Decay. And so you both can step away from the microphone and then I have the gentleman who will be responding to the general knowledge questions. Who do we have for Qatar Senior High School, Francis? Yeah. And for St. Francis Xavier? Roger. Roger. So Roger against Francis. First question. Identify the term frequently used in computer science to refer to procedures like those used for sorting lists or pathfinding. I'm sorry, my bell is gone. The correct answer, gentlemen, is algorithms. Algorithms. On this type of port device, on this type of port device, can use bulk, interrupt or isochronous data transfer modes. For standard connectors, its first and fourth pins are used for power, while the other two are used for data. The maximum transfer speed is 480 megabytes per second for the 2.0 standard and nearly 5 gigabytes 
per second for the 3.0 standard. For 10 points, name this standard that defines connections used by peripherals such as flash drives and mice. Yes, Francis? USB. I'm going to accept that. USB, yes. I was looking for the universal serial bus, but USB is correct. And so you get 10 points for providing the correct answer to that particular question. And ladies and gentlemen, this brings us to the end of the fourth round and effectively the end of the Sharks Academic Quiz Competition or Contest between St. Francis Xavier Senior High School and Keta Senior High School from the Volta region. The fourth round results, St. Francis Xavier had zero and Keta Senior High School scored 10 points. Please put your hands together for them. At the end of the contest, one school had a total of 85 points, and the other school had 140 points. Please put your hands together for them. It is my singular honor to tell you that Keta Senior High School were the sharks and legends of this competition as they registered 140 points over their counterparts from St. Francis Xavier Senior High School. And this brings us to the end of this contest. To St. Francis Xavier, this is the end of the journey, but not the end of the learning experience. We hope you prepare adequately for the next competition that will be organized and come out on top as sharks and legends. To Kita Senior High School, there are other legends you'll be joining, and at that point, you determine whether you can survive or not. But for the moment, congratulations for having made it through to the next round of the competition.